Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Wonder Kid Watch where today we're taking a look at Isaac Bergman Johannesson, uh, the Icelandic youngster playing for Copenhagen who's recently moved to. Um, it's He's a very good looking player, very well rounded in his position as well. Uh, definitely more of a centre midfielder I'd argue um, because of kind of the variety and well roundedness of him. He's six foot so he can still work on his aerial ability in the future and has already made four appearances for Iceland so certainly someone who could develop quite nicely. Um, obviously the recent move to Copenhagen might give you a bit of trouble trouble signing him initially um, but if we take a look at his potential ability 158 is very very good with 109 current ability so he could even slot into any team already um, especially for someone who's developing but let's jump ahead take a look at how he gets on 10 years on uh, and see his progression. Here we are then at Liverpool Football Club. Seems like he's found a very, very good team to join for that high pressing sort of style that I'm sure he could work very, very well in with good work, great vision, stamina and agility, along with plenty of good passing stats as well. Um, 89 caps for Iceland, 12 goals scored. So he is in a very crucial part of that team. 28 years old now, so in his prime years, that's for sure. Uh, it can still play a range of positions and probably could develop to play more if you really wanted him to um history though we can see that he obviously made that move to Copenhagen that we knew about um and then he played very very well for them uh, a good few seasons getting 13 goals and seven assists in one season uh, otherwise performing very very well before a 25.5 million pound mood which I'd argue is an absolute steal for a player of his quality um to Liverpool where he's again just continued to play very very well uh that's undoubtedly for sure um Let's take a look, though, at his milestones. How's he got on with regards to that? Competitions, you can see he's got his first cap for Ireland that we knew about. Um, Super League of Champions and the Sidbank Polkelen winners as well, which we can see obviously would happen in with Copenhagen in the Super League uh, in Denmark. But he's also won the Carabao Cup as well with Liverpool and got to a final of the Champions League, which is very, very cool. Um, named in European Champions League Dream Team, so that's very, very good. He's been recognised renownedly for that. Um, named in the 2030 English Division Team of the Year. So he's obviously a very crucial part of Liverpool's uh, performances as he's been recognised by that, by the whole league. And of course, look at how well he's played um, for Copenhagen. You can see all those different um, awards that he's won individually, including like Super League Spring Player of the Year, that sort of stuff. So he's a very, very good player. I'd recommend him. Uh, I had him in FIFA, FIFA. God, don't mention that. That's horrible. Um, FM21, I should say. Uh, and he was very good then. And he looks to be very, very good now. Uh, certainly someone that I always want to pick up if you can. But before we go, we must check his attributes. Has he reached his potential? 158 out of 158. Absolutely, he has. A phenomenal player. Looks very, very nice. Certainly one I'd bring in to the side just for his versatility uh, alone, let alone how good he is anyway as a midfielder. But there you go. We'll leave it at that. Make sure you leave a like. Subscribe to the channel. Of course, leave a comment down below of any players you want to see in Wonder Kid Watch in the next few episodes. And I will catch you in the next one.